Hey, what's going on everyone? It's Sean from All Things EV and uh, I'm in my car. I don't have my normal camera, so I'm doing this on my phone on the fly because the news just broke by Reuters that GM and Amazon are interested in a minority stake in Rivian Automotive. And I wanna provide my thoughts in real time here because I think that this could move pretty quickly. Uh, first thing is uh, the, the Rivian, they say in this article, is valued at one to $2 billion. And that sounds about right based on my conversation with uh, the CEO of Rivian, RJ Scaringe from two or three weeks ago back in Aspen, he he talked about how uh, it takes at least a billion dollars to get, get this up and running successfully. So that's, that seems to line up. Um, the rumor that GM and Amazon are considering a minority stake makes a ton of sense to me based on something that I heard from a conversation. Well, uh, let me back up. Based on Based on a conversation I had with a couple of people that I can't mention, um, this seems to line up with something that they shared with me. And so I, I actually believe this rumor. I believe that um, th that it's something that that is is reliable, a reliable uh, piece of information. And I, th I think that the rumor has some good credence to be pretty true. Um, I don't know for a fact, but uh, it seems to line up with with a conversation that I had with someone else recently. My thoughts on 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 GM uh, tapping on Rivian. I think this is interesting. First of all, I think that Rivian doesn't need the money. Rivian doesn't need the capital. They're very well funded, and I think that um, here's my concern. <laughs> my concern is that Rivian has a ton of potential, and because they have so much funding, I think that they could that they could run on their own, be successful without any help from any major uh, any major companies like GM and Amazon. GM needs Rivian because they are so far behind in their EV platform, and especially as large of a market as a pickup truck and, and an SUV for that matter. Uh, the, 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 the Amazon thing is, is quite interesting to me. I think that they've got some interest in the autonomy piece that, that Rivian is, is working towards. And of course, that, that is directly in line with helping them deliver vehicles, sorry, helping them deliver packages uh, that come from orders from Amazon.com. I think Ford is in the same situation where they're extremely far behind with their EV platform. And uh, I'm actually quite surprised that that uh, f it wasn't Ford uh, that that uh, th that we're hearing in the news, because I think I think they're even f farther off than than GM is. But uh, good for GM. So uh, I mean, I'm curious to see what the minority stake turns into. Does this give GM access to Rivian's technology? Does it give GM access to uh, just just investment dollars? Uh, this will be really interesting for me to 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 discover, for all of us to discover, because um, you know what I think GM really needs is is I think they they need Rivian's tech in their own vehicles, and it's possible that Rivian might license out or produce uh, the the skateboard platform for GM to be able to sell. Um, you know, it, do, it does remove a little bit of a, a competitive advantage for Rivian. So I, I think I think that there are, are two things that, that would work against Rivian, right? They're giving away their competitive advantage and uh, they could potentially be um, um, uh, distracting themselves from really just dominating this market and gaining market share. Uh, however, you know, if you think about this from accelerating the 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 uh, advent of of re, accelerating the, the the advent of like electric vehicles that's what i'm trying to say um I, I think it does make a lot of sense in 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 that way so i'm really curious to to know what you all think about this in the comments down below because this is definitely uh, th this is this is rumored this hasn't been confirmed by anyone but this is definitely something that i think 
uh, will likely develop into facts and, and truth here in the next couple of weeks, maybe. Uh, now, now, that the, now that the information has leaked, it probably will move pretty quickly. But sound off in the comments down below. Do you think this is a good thing that Rivian is uh, considering a minority stake or giving a minority stake to GM and Amazon? Uh, or do you think it's a bad thing because they're giving away um, a little bit of their competitive advantage? Sean Mitchell, all things EV. Sound off in the comments down below. See you in the next video.